In this lecture, let's implement the DS1307 set current date function. It's very simple. So you have to just check the data sheet here. You have to program these register addresses day, date, month, and year addresses. Straight away, you can write the BCD values into these addresses. Simple data, I2C data write you have to perform. That's why here is a code. Very simple. You just have to execute four writes. Before writing, just convert the values into BCD. Date, month, year, and day to these addresses. Date is address 4. Like that. Very simple, isn't it? Let's compile this. Yeah, so it works. No problem. These are set functions. Now let's implement the get functions. First, we'll implement get current time. That means you have to now read from those RTC chip addresses and you have to update this pointer which is supplied by the user. So here we have to perform a couple of read operations. Let me just create one variable called seconds to fetch the seconds value. Seconds is equal to DS1307 read. Read from the address DS1307 ADDR seconds. The value what I got here is in BCD format. We have to convert that into binary. But before that, you have to make sure that the bit number 7 is cleared because that is not relevant for us. That's why seconds bitwise and is equal to 1 shifted by 7. Sorry, here you have to use negation of. After that, RTC underscore time of seconds is equal to BCD2 binary conversion you have to do on this variable seconds and after that let's go for RTC underscore time let's populate the minutes is equal to BCD2 binary of the data what you read from The minutes address. Fine. After that, let's go for us. Let's create one variable here. Us is equal to ds1307 read from the us register address. So this is in BCD. Remember, you have to clear a couple of fields because we don't want bit number 6 these things you have to remove bit 6 and bit 5 details you have to remove let's do one thing here first let's test the bit number 6 to understand what's the format whether it's a 12 hour format or 24 hour format if as bitwise and of 1 shifted by 6 if this is set then it's 12 hour format. Else it is 24 hour format. So if it is a 24 hour format, then we can just conclude the time format field here as it is time format 24 hours. That's it. But if it is 12 hour format, then we have to update this time format whether it is pm or am and that decision we can make based on bit number 5 if bit number 5 is set to 1 then it's pm so you can again use another if condition to do that or i can just do something like this here rtc time format is equal to Let's test for bit number 5. Bit number 5. So if it is 0, if this statement is true, then it is actually AM. What's the code for AM? It is 0. 
So if this is true, then we'll just do a not of that. Very simple code. Here we are testing. Let me put one more parenthesis here. So test for bit number five. If it is zero, then this whole statement becomes one. In the time format, we store not of one, that is zero, because the code for AM is zero. Suppose if this test results in non zero, then this statement will result in zero. Not of zero is one, that means the code for PM is one, like that. Let me remove these spaces here. After taking the decisions, you have to clear sixth and fifth positions. After that, let's store the value into the OS field of the structure. Before storing, you have to convert BCD to binary. Let's compile this. Yeah, so it compiles, no problem. I'll give this as an assignment to you. So you go ahead and implement get current date function. You can also look into our source code if you want any help. <laughs>